welcome back to Hong Kong. We're here at the Hong Kong Park and it's absolutely unbelievably beautiful. Look at this. Today we already had a plan to go up to the Victoria Peak but it's Sunday morning and it was absolutely swamped with tourists. So the plan slightly changed and now we're going to check out Hong Kong Park and then grab a bus all the way over to the Artist Village and then the National Museum of History and then see some cool tower. But in the meantime, look at these turtles. God, it's hot. I'm gonna jump in the waterfall. I'm gonna do it, I don't care. Okay, time to move on. That was cool. Daniel rather reasonably stayed at the bottom of those steps. We did not. I don't know about Alina. But I want to go up there. But I don't want to make him wait. So I think we're going to go for a little jog right now. Well, the view isn't even that good. Oh, okay. Okay, I guess that's pretty beautiful. That's where we wanted to go, but could not get to. Hopefully tomorrow. Can't keep you waiting, Daniel. We're coming for you. Okay, where to next? Right now, we're off to the bus station. We'll see you in about 20 minutes when we're on the other side of Hong Kong at the artist, Artist's Village. And it's so f***ing hot. Sorry. It's so hot. Say okay. Okay! <laughs> So at that very moment in time, I realized that I had left this brand new microphone on the bus. Thank God the bus's next stop was right around the corner, so I was able to stop it and get my microphone and put it back on the camera. But when I did, something went wrong here and some of the clips lost their audio. So I'm going to do my best to edit the rest of this. Hopefully I can narrate over it. Anyway, that's what happened. Back to the show. So we made it to the Hong Kong Museum of History, which was incredible and free. They didn't allow recording, so I kind of had to hide my camera for these shots and busted. Okay, so that's a wrap on the National History Museum here in Hong Kong. That was one of the best museums. Entertaining, immersive, and free. We're off to the Royal Garden Hotel. Daniel claims they have a garden up top. We'll see what it looks like. Not exactly what we expected, but it was still really cool to see. That's all we had planned for that day, so we went off to find some nightlife. To catch you up, we got a beer, we had a good dinner, and yeah, now we're in like, hopefully one of the cooler party areas of the city where all the young people go to drink and hang out. Local people. So we started here and we got a tip that the best place to go 
over here by Central is here. And we're here. This is it. This is uh, Party City. So as a lot of the online places recommended, we're going to go to Club 7-Eleven and get some to-go beers. I guess what they say about Club 7-Eleven is true. This is literally just a liquor store. And it's a 7-Eleven. If you need any more proof, hanging outside the 7-Eleven are some very convenient bottle openers. We have officially made it out to Lang Kwai Fong, which is honestly the coolest party street we've seen. There's actually locals here, awesome cheap beer, and yeah, as you can see down there. It's just one cheap awesome bar after another. For tomorrow, we have Victoria Peak lined up and some temples. We're finally gonna see some temples. So, I think we're gonna call it a night for tonight. Great day. Cheers. See you tomorrow. bunch of struggles on the way. The tram wasn't running, so we had to take the bus. They closed the second and obviously better half of the observation deck. And lastly, as you can see, unfortunately, it's kind of foggy out. But uh, yeah, we made it and it's beautiful. So check. Now we're gonna go visit some temples, try to fit that in before we get to our flight later tonight. Yes, I did check. Beautiful. All right, so we just got out of the taxi. Taxi man said, you go up, so we go up. Uh, and hopefully there will be a temple at the top of these stairs. Okay, pretty sure that's it. Manmo Temple, it was beautiful. Incense hanging, lanterns, incense everywhere. It was actually really powerful, the smell. So we couldn't stay in there for too long, but we have about two hours till our flight, so just gonna kill some time and see what we find. Okay, uh, despite having like an hour and a half at the airport to do absolutely nothing, we still managed to plan it poorly and we are rushing to board the plane. But really quickly, just to wrap up, Hong Kong blew me away. This was like amazing. I felt like I was in a modern utopia. Must so, visit. Must visit. Thanks for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed. Um, we gotta board our flight. Okay, see you in the next video. Subscribe. Bye bye. All right, that's it. Time to board the plane. <laughs> Just kidding. I'll go get in line. You could just do it maybe one more time here, just really quickly. <laughs> as soon as you have the green light. <laughs> 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 I love this car.